I will be showing you uh, two phonics rules that will really help new readers be able to decode new words. Um, and there's also rule breakers, and it's good to show children that there are rule breakers to look out for. Um, one of the rules that's pretty consistent is when a vowel is at the end of a word, it will make a long sound. Like in no, go, me, and hi. And go ahead and show them, here's a rule breaker, two. And once a child learns that, they can just be ready for that rule breaker, two. And then there's also another one in the same family. Do. And we'll just get used to those, but most of the other words they come to that have a vowel at the end of a word will be long. And that way when they come to them, it'll just be much easier to read those. So we just teach that. And then the other rule once they've learned their long and short vowel sounds that they can be ready for is if a vowel is trapped between two consonants all by itself, it says it's short name, short sound, almost always. So we can go from no to, when you see it all by itself there, you're going to think short sound. Oh, what is that? Ah, ah, then they're ready. N Ought, not. And then when they look at this, it's g, o. They think long sound, o, at the end of a word all by itself. When it gets trapped, then they can start to think, oh, I want the short sound, ah, g, g, ought, got. And we can go on to the me. They're ready for the long sound. But when it's trapped by itself, in the middle, they think short sound. What is it? That's right. Eh. And then they're ready for it. Met. Met. They make themselves the word. They read the word. I. Hi. They were ready for the long sound because they knew it was at the end. And now the child knows the rules to reading. If it's trapped in the middle, they're going to be ready to make the short sound, which they know. If, if, and they think if before they start to read. Hit, hit. Those are two rules that will um, take a child real far in reading. So I would suggest trying to read that. If you don't have magnetic letters, try writing the words. However you can get this across to a child, it will really help.